upon how your sleep studies come out. If you have a sleep study that's suggestive of mild or moderate or severe sleep apnea, you're going to work with both your physician as well as a pulmonologist in some settings to decide what is the best treatment for you. In many cases, lifestyle modification is the first thing. A little weight loss can go a long way when you're talking about an obstruction that may be affecting your neck. If you don't necessarily benefit from that, they may talk about doing different breathing machines at night. Sometimes different mouth guards can help people if they're having a problem with breathing with their mouth open. Or CPAP machines, obviously, we hear a lot about. Until we know what type of sleep apnea you have and have that conversation with your physician and your pulmonologist, it's hard to decide what type of treatment you may necessarily benefit the most from.